It's 2.45 on Wednesday, Eastern Standard Time. That means we're live. That's right, we're live at the Fabio Spine Sports Rehab. Thanks for tuning in. Hey, share, subscribe. I really want to get to a million subscribers. That's, that's going to be cool. My Planner for Shyness video has got over 2 million views, so let's get those people to subscribe. What we've been talking about the last couple of uh, videos was about back exercises, and specifically what was bad for your back. Let's say you're having back pain and you want to start doing something. Let's say you're just starting to feel a little bit better and you want to start training the core. It's essential you create a strong core. It creates a natural support belt for your back. And we're going to talk about Stuart McGill's top three exercises for core stability. And they're essential to help stimulate strengthening of your stabilizer muscles. You have two different groups of muscles in your body. You have strengthening muscles that create power and speed and acceleration, and then you have stabilizer muscles that don't create movement, that don't create speed, but stabilize the joint so when the power muscles pull on it, you don't get injured and it gives you good leverage. That's what stability of the core is all about, is engaging those muscles. And by the way, did you know that your rectus abdominis, your six pack, is not a core stabilizer? So you can hit your rectus all day long and it's not going to help stabilize and protect your lower back from injury. But what will? Let's start with the first exercise. It's called the McGill Curl Up. Mike's going to show it to us. Lying flat on your back, put one hand behind your lower back. Now this has a progression. This is just the first exercise of the progression. You want to keep the curve in the lower back, all right? Maintaining that alignment, a little bit of stiffness, tighten your abs a touch, and then just raise your head and shoulders. Go ahead. Right there, that's it. You only want to come up about an inch and go back down. All the movement occurs from here, keeping the back's back stable. First is to brace, tighten the abs, and then curl up. That's it, McGill curl up. Hold for two seconds, slowly go back down. It's not coming up all the way with a crunch. A crunch we talked about is one of the worst exercises for your lower back. It creates too much pressure on the discs. The second exercise is going to be a side plank. Mike, let's go over onto your side. Hips are stacked, knees are stacked. We start in a, in a three-point position with the knees bent. Shoulders are stacked. Protect that shoulder by just draping your arm here. Same thing. First, tighten up the abs. Tighten your abs and then bridge up. Okay? First one, right in through here, should be pretty comfortable for you unless your back is still pretty inflamed. Hold for two seconds, slowly go back down. Start with a two second hold on all of these, build up to three sets of 15 to 20, then we can talk about getting more aggressive. Tighten the abs first, bridge up, and go back down. Again, there's a progression on this, we'll talk about that in a future show. This is for people still in pain, just starting to feel better, or just got out of pain. Face up. The other one is called the iso oblique. This you can start relatively early. Let's do uh, demonstrating this um, knee and this arm. So this knee and this arm go up against one another and you push against, okay? Creating an isometric Charles Atlas compression. Keeping the lumbar spine in neutral. We're not flattening none of the Pilates stuff. Push. This you can hold a little bit longer. Slowly push. Hold for six seconds, slowly release, okay? Ideally, we keep this leg up. I just got it out of the way so that you could see a little bit better. And then, of course, you do the opposite side where you're just keeping a neutral spine and then push. And that engages you to teach yourself how to brace those deep core stabilizers. Those are Stuart McGill's top three core stabilization exercises. We'll go over the progression of each one of those in the next few weeks. Thanks for tuning in. It's 1445 on Wednesdays. I'm Dr. D. Share me, subscribe, talk to you soon.